So you guys are probably wondering why is she driving around at two in the morning going to school? I've done this in the past where I'd get up early and I would go to the library and study. Whatever works for you works. I never used to sacrifice my sleep back in the day just because I didn't, I believe that your body does and your brain needs eight hours of sleep at least to retain everything. But in this case where I can't sleep, which happens a lot the night before an exam, I wake up early and just go to the library. This is really early. I'm meeting up with my friends, so I'm not gonna be there by myself. And I just wanna show you guys the realness. A lot of people tell me, keep filming a day in the life. I haven't been filming those because I haven't been so busy with schoolwork anymore because it's the last academic year. Like you guys are probably sick of me saying it, but when it gets down to the needy greedy and it gets real this is what i have to show you is me waking up at this time and all i did was study and i must have cried at least three times yeah i honestly this class is hard it sucks when you try so hard and you don't th get the results you know you deserve so in that case you have to just keep pushing whether it's your school or job you just have to continue going even when you lose your momentum and i feel like i've kind of lost that so <sighs> no it is time for my cafecito i am lucky that i live by a dunkin donuts that's 24 hours so that's a plus because i don't know how i would make it um, although in school they have a, the vending machine with Red Bull and Monsters. I'm gonna order my friend her coffee. She's not as lucky as me to have a Dunkin's that is open this early. I have to see what she wants. And I came across this video and it just hit like to the T of how I was feeling. And he started off by saying, put God first. Something that sometimes we lose because we're so caught up in doing so much in our lives um, but he's right I remember praying to be in this position and so this morning I didn't wake up upset I woke up ready and determined and thankful that I'm in this position and God is leading my way and any struggle or any speed bump that I come across is for a reason and if you're watching me right now and i know this lighting is terrible but remember it's like two in the morning but if you're watching me right now whether it's school or work or going through something in your family you're going to just do something that's hard and you're just losing faith don't lose faith and reach out to god and pray put god First, everything that I have is by the grace of God. Remember this, to get something you never had, you have to do something you never did. I found that nothing in life is worthwhile unless you take risks. Nothing. Keep striving, never give up, fall down seven times, get up eight. If you don't fail, you're not even trying. Fail big. You will fail at some point in your life. Accept it. You will lose. You will embarrass yourself. You will suck at something. There's no doubt about it. Ease is a greater threat to progress than hardship. You only live once. So do what you feel passionate about. Keep moving, keep growing, keep learning. 